Hello and welcome to another episode of For the King. Um, so we just cleared the glittering mines and now we need to go to Parade in the Golden Plains that's up here. And we probably just want to kill everything we can along the way, so... These are all pretty low level enemies, I guess, because we're back in the starting area, I think, so... We can just, we can take all these. It is just two of our party, but I think we can <laughs> this guy off. to heal along the way and stock up on healing items. Oh, uh, yeah, um, no. Okay, um, do you have enough gold? Good check the... Wait, is it not nighttime? It is nighttime. Why does it look like it's locked? That's odd. Anyway, I'm gonna go over there. I want to see what they have. Plus four attack damage is really good. Um, hmm. Some interesting stuff here. Uh, lock picks would be good to have. And what's this? Ah. Um. Okay. I'm a bit tempted by the amulet of souls. Hmm. I'd lose my gold multiplier, or at least some of it. I don't know. I don't even. Um, I'd lose that much of it. I don't know if I had other stuff that was giving me a multiplier like that. Nope. Um, but it was only 5%, and being able to do so much more damage would be really, really helpful. So. I'm gonna do that for now. Alright. That was worthwhile. Um. Now. Just try to get everyone somewhat close together so. I run into a unexpected enemy. They'll be able to help each other out. Heal a little 
bed. How, uh, why did I have to okay, level 3? Yeah, this stuff should be manageable, but I probably don't want to go into any big fights with someone at less than half health. Alright, um... be better to just go do the ancient quarry. So I'll just move him up there and rest. Okay. Enemy health is now at 110%. boulder that does not resemble the local rock formations. A large embedded gem glows malevolently. How does something glow malevolently? Um, okay. Well, let's fight him. It's just one round. How hard could it be? Oh. Uh, my memory is long, yet you are strange to me. No matter. I will enjoy dismantling you into chaos. How original. Actually, I've never heard anyone say that before, so I guess it is isn't true. Uh, unfortunately for you, GMOs, we are on level 3, and you are only level 2. So while that did hurt a little bit, you're about to get hurt on the horse. Uh, just share. Oh. oh, plus four armor, plus fifteen max health. Immune to all this stuff. Hmm. Um. Yeah, we'll just have her collect that for now. Um, I like increase damage better than just having someone extremely tanky. But I might need that later. Um can't quite make it to parade. Um just have him move up a little bit and some more. Roasting fresh game over a campfire. You are invited to share the bounty. It's a four percent chance of a fight. I guess alcohol is involved, but not very much. Um, yeah, sure, that could help. I got some XP. Nice. That would have. That's better than just getting some 
like a little tiny bit of health anyway, so. Alright. <laughs> oh, what? We stumbled upon catac catacombs. Many dungeons are short but cannot be escaped, etc. Okay, that's level three. We could do that soonish, I suppose. Um, the chaos levels are worrying me, but it would be a good way to gain some XP and maybe equipment as well. Probably want to just do it on the way to something, though. Alright, welcome to Parade. I am Drea Power, Queen Rosamond's uh, prime agent in these troubled times. That fell tower is Harazul, a cursed place and the source of chaos. It is protected by a shield which we need to bring down. I know a way. Seek the key fragments at these locations. That's a long ways away. We know a dreaded Mind Lord is in possession of one key fragment. Seek him in the Rogue Isles. Uh, there is a key fragment in the L Light Lit Lich's Crypt located in the Burning Forest. Take great care in that haunted place. Okay. Uh, we believe a key fragment is within Forgotten Cellar, but its location is unknown. It will be tight quarters when you find it, and explorers don't tend to return. Alright. Um. Quest forage. Reduce chaos. Um. Kill a chaos henchman. Ooh. Curved bow. That would actually be helpful. Um. A area attack, I believe. Um, first, let's see what's in the market, though. If I could just buy a better bow, then that'd be good. Um, Alright. Uh, upgrade our pipe. That will increase the effectiveness of everything herb that we use, um, although I suppose I mostly just need to upgrade her pipe so she can heal everyone effectively. Um, okay. I guess this is a bit of a tough call. I, the chaos levels really stress me out, um, and I'll probably find a better weapon sooner or later but there are very limited ways to reduce chaos, so I'm gonna accept this bounty. And the objective is very conveniently placed. Huh. Um, except that there's this bison tour camp here, but they are level two, I suppose. He's level four, though. Um, yeah. Uh, how much does it cost to stay at the end? I'm gonna do that and rest up before the battle. Okay. Um, I think we can probably do this. A couple of us are level four. Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's just do it. chance to ignore our Mario. The middle guy and hopefully we'll turn down nicely. Ouch. Oh my, I think five focus. 
is that only focus? Uh, okay. Yeah, I definitely have better weapons. Um, especially since health is increasing the max health of all of the enemies. Uh, yeah, I can't finish them off either way, so... has diminished, we have a chance for now. Stop it! Get out of my face. Uh. Oh. Okay. Um. Yeah. So that. And that. And now we have more than enough. Um. Nice. Okay. That should. That should get us at least to the next town. Um. And I guess that was kind of a boring end to the video, but. I think, eh, I guess, let's go kill this bison tour next turn and then we'll end the video after that. Uh, wait a minute, oh, okay, he's in range of a lot of people. Ah, uh, this could actually go really badly. 
I would, I wanted a little more excitement in the video, but not as much as this could be kind of, okay, good. I'll take down the one by Centaur, because they have tons of armor and tons of health. And they do tons of damage. They don't have, well, the only thing they don't have tons of is accuracy, but when they do hit, it's bad. Okay, that was actually not very exciting at all, but that's okay. Since more exciting might have meant, like, serious dent being put into the health of my party. So, who is this? Okay, my hunter. I'd actually like him to use this sanctum, I think. I'm actually not sure if this is the best fit for him. Might go better on the blacksmith. Uh, sure, we'll put it on the blacksmith instead. That, makes, that, that test says stuff that he doesn't have very much of, so. Okay. Anyway, bit of a more uneventful episode, I guess, but we did progress in the main story a little bit, and. I guess in the next video we will be trying to find those keys. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.